is every city is 100% supplied with everything and all the cities are growing. That is the eventual goal. Is that likely to happen? No. Not likely at all. I'm likely to give up way before then. <laughs> Just being honest. But that's the goal. Whoops, I didn't mean to upgrade. I meant to set line. There we go. And, yeah, on my easy one, I, I was way too hasty. And again, it, it came from fast forwarding. Honestly. But I was way too hasty in my... Um, in my planning. Okay, so our first truck is now getting here, which this rate might jump up now that he's going through there. We'll find out. It's 28 right now. We'll see if it jumps up once once he stops there. <clears throat> yeah, see, it jumped up to 31. And so our, our stuff moved around here. Um, wow. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. Look at this. We're nearly operating in the green. I mean, we're going to be spending more money and, you know, this is going to go up. But as of right this second, we're nearly operating in the green. That's nice. Operating in the green is a good thing. So the idea here again is I am you know let's check in on let's check in on this one. See we're supplying there. We're we're doing good. Okay. This the demand has gone up. Our our, our rate is 47. There's 73% demand. That's that's okay. Eventually see look now when we connect the two cities though this blue line is going to have to supply like I was saying that 52 Plus that 43 so we're looking at 95 so I want I will want that rate to be 95 roughly then this yellow line will be doing that 47 plus 53 so 100 so to make it easy we'll probably just do both at 100 honestly and then that means that this will be sending 50 this way and this will be sending 50 this way so our distro, not our distro, our freight back and forth will have to have a rate of 50 um, to be able to cover everything going back and forth and to not have too many trucks. If you have too many trucks, then some of them will start to be empty. And so then my distro from here will be able to have to be able to handle again how much I'm bringing in here fuel 47 and how much ever I'm sending from here to here so again we're gonna run it up to 100 my distro will be have to be able to handle 100 to give all the food and all the fuel that it needs and I'll want the whole city covered and then once I start my once I start my transportation which I won't do for a while. Oh, I didn't see how much I made on that. Dang it. Well, I wonder if it's in finances. Okay. Um, there we go. 7,000. So, perfect. One trip makes me about 20,000. But I'm not going to set up my passenger lines until... I have all my cargo lines for the simple fact that I don't want my towns to grow too fast. And I'm not sure how fast they're going to grow, to be totally honest with you. I, I don't know how fast they're going to grow. I um, Because I'm, I'm so used to fast forwarding it. Oh, and if you're watching this on YouTube, YouTube, <laughs> YouTube. On YouTube, it looks like we are already in video three because yeah, zero to two, three to five, and this will be six to eight. 1856 to 1858. 
And I don't know how long I'm going to be live streaming tonight. But probably for a few more hours anyway. If I've done my maths right, each video will be roughly 40 minutes long on YouTube. And it'd be nice to get me four, five, six, seven, eight, all right at once. That'd be great. But my goal with this game, like I said, I, I don't really have a quote unquote goal per se, like, oh, make so much money by this. You know, I don't have that kind of goal. But my goal, oh wow, I only lost that much money. But my goal is to actually just take, to survive. I mean, that's, that's the goal, however it is, to survive all the way into at least the current year 2020. This is being recorded on January 15th of 2020. It probably won't go up onto YouTube for several weeks though, uh, simply because I've got other stuff in the queue. Um, it, uh, I've still got some more Vampire the Masquerade to upload. In fact, I've only got one more video of that and I'm happy with that. Which that's hilarious to watch that now because I played that nearly half a year ago and I'm finally uploading it. And it took me 19 hours or 20 hours, something like that, to beat the game. But now I speedrun the game. And right now my personal best using the Tremere Clan on version 1.2 is 1 hour and 13 minutes. But I'm about to switch over to the Nosferatu. Um, they're faster. I'm also starting to use... Uh, Version 1.1, it's got a couple glitches that version 1.2 pat, uh, patched out. So speedrunners use version 1.1. And I am doing that. I just, I need to work on my routing because I've been practicing um, Tremere Clan so much. Oh, hey, we're starting to come back. Okay, if we're coming back, then that means I'm at the point where... I can just buy a few. We're going to buy three. One, two, three. And we're going to go ahead and hit that and see what this pops up to. 39. Like I said, we're going to go up to 45. So let's try one, two, three again. And fuel it up. 42. Let's try two. See what it hops up to. 44. One more. Boom. All right, so we're at 45. And we can close all this out because we know we're good. Um, there we go. So we are shortly going to hopefully be operating in the green. Making lots of money per year. Because I mean, like I said, look at this. Last year, even with buying 137 and that 30k, we were only down. 2.5 k We're going to be down a little bit this year simply because I bought all those right at the end instead of waiting. Because once once the first truck gets back here, you're like, eh, I may as well not space them out anymore. I've got plenty of production there. So now, I worry about... I have, I have a choice to make. I can either... make these more efficient or I can start connecting the two towns I'm honestly not sure which one I want to do once I connect the two towns then yeah once I connect the two towns then I can just bump up production here quickly I'm gonna want to bypass there for sure Absolutely going to want to bypass there. Um, probably go straight from here to here. Make it easy. Actually, I might even go from here to slightly in like that. But then I'm going to want... Hmm. I'm not sure. I'm not sure yet. We've got lots of ways to do this. Um, so many ways. Now, 
while I'm, I'm, I'm going to let the, this route run for a bit while I think about what I'm going to do over here, because over here I saw a factory here. Okay. If I can get wood or steel, I can then bring that into carry. Well, there's wood right there. Now, let's turn this on. There's wood right there. Is there a wood chopper anywhere? There's not a wood chopper anywhere nearby. See, you want steel anyway, um, so you can get both of these producing. Um, it seemed to me last time I played that if both of them weren't at high production, it wouldn't go up. You had to have both of them at high production. So you want steel. Um, there's my steel maker. Or, or, do I have a quarry nearby? Because we've got one across the river. Construction materials would be good for this. Um, no. Hmm. Let's take a look down here. See what we got down here. Um, we've got a town here. And see, this would be nice. Because it's still triangly. I wouldn't go from here to here. I'd go in a triangle. But what can it produce? I've got stone. And I've got construction materials right there. Okay. Uh, put a path right here. And boom. This could be my construction materials. Which would then mean... Hmm. That I would... Yeah. Okay. Okay. Because then this could connect pretty much... Not exactly there. Might bypass it a bit. This could go straight up here and hit this to, for the bypass. And I could use the same distro there. I could put my distro out here and put a distro up here. That's what I could do. That might be the way to do it. Okay, so stone here or there. Okay. Because I can use either stone or slag to make construction material. Um, is there a quarry? Let's see, what do we got near Inglewood here? We've got wood there. Lots of places to make fuel. Hmm. I think that that's probably my best bet here is to go, okay, Flint, go from here, make a line here, because I want this to be as near this as I can, so make a line here, boom, to go up here, so basically straighten that out is what I would do, um, then, see, I delete a bunch of this road is what I do, honestly, um, if I had, okay, there's a cheat to get infinite money. I'm not going to do that, obviously. But if I had infinite money, that's what I would do. As soon as I started, I'd be like, okay, delete the roads. Bum, 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 delete the roads. Make my own paths to where I want to go so they're perfectly straight. Um, which, hilariously, later on, I may as well have infinite money. Um, that's just the way it works. Um, but, for now... That's what I'll probably do. I'll probably set up here, go from here straight to here, from here, actually go up here. Probably connect it from there, bypass there, and then have it go straight here again. That will give me a nice, it'll give me construction materials here. Then this, like I said, from that will probably go straight up to here connect to my distro center out here and probably run another line right up to here which would then connect to my distro center down here and yeah I mean that's that's nice um, I think I've got a plan and I would have made a hundred thousand if it weren't for new vehicles and loan interest no I'd have made more than that I made a hundred and thirty thousand Man. 
but I'm in the green. 1957 and I'm in the green. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm not going to work on this one yet, though. But now that I know, I'm going to put my distro center out here. Okay. So I am, let's see here, from here, it's going to go on this side of it. Boom. Somewhere around here. So I do want to go ahead and make this I think I mean this distro center is easy it's just going to be down here just south of the city um, I think hmm I think building a bypass here is a good way to start because then I can put my distro center well yeah I can put my distro center like right here I think that's what I want to do. So, all right, so here's my goal. My goal is to not ever go back in the red. That way I can pay this off. Later on, when I'm out of debt, if I go into the red, oh well. It's just about whether I have the money or not. But until I'm out of debt, I don't want to go in the red. Because it's not about how much money I have, it's about how much debt I have and working myself out of debt, which the thing is, okay, my vehicles are still halfway. They, they can last for 15 years. Okay, um, we're going to start building a bypass, and it's going to go from right here. You know what? It's going to go from right here all the way to right there. So... Let's grab our road tool here. Um, see, now I would like it to be, I see it's still 50 miles per hour. Hey, let me do. Let's save this. Um, enter a file name. Live stream. Hard mode. There we go. And I'm actually going to quit to the menu and come back. That way, um, okay. Continue. Now, hopefully, it's changed to the kilometers per hour and stuff instead of still being miles per hour. Okay, pull this up right away. Put it right there. Okay, uh, la, 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 where were we? Right here. Hey, there we are. Okay, so this has 60 kilo 80 kilometers per hour. I'm not gonna need anything higher than there's 25 there 30 until 1930 I won't need higher than 30 kilometers per hour so what is this that's 40 when okay from 1930 I'm not gonna need anything higher than 40 up until 1970 so I'm just gonna do this okay. and I can't add a bus lane yet Let's see, even this small country road. That's a small street. We're going to do a medium country road. That's 60. Dang it. You know what? Let's just go ahead and do this. Boom. I made an executive decision. So you want it to start right here. So I'm not actually going to start there. I'm going to go here. And I want it to shoot pretty much straight that way. So I'm going to go up here. I'm going I'm to go about 5k. Boom. Boom. There we go. Now, like I said before, you don't want to stretch this all the way out. Like As I proved with this road here, it was going to cost me 15,000 to go from here to here. But I made it last only do 10,000 by doing stretches of 5k. And that's because of all the road terraforming, basically. So I'm only going to go about 5k-ish. Sometimes it'll be shorter, sometimes it'll be longer. But basically, I'm watching my yearly... Oh yeah, and look, here's, here's why I didn't actually connect to the road, okay? If I would have connected to this, it would curve all over the place. If I try to go straight there, 
Oh yeah, well that construction's not possible. Let's say I try to start here. Eh, that's that's not bad. It's not too bad actually. But it's trying to curve on me as I connect it, you know. So basically I've if you don't actually start on the road, then now I can be like, oh, there's my connection. Okay. So now I just come up here. And since this this part is straight now. I can make this straight. See? Go back and forth, it's still gonna be straight. Bring it to about five. Then again, I'm watching this number. I'm not watching how much money I have left. I'm watching this number. I do not want to exceed. I don't want this to go in the red. So I am watching that number. That way I can eventually get out of debt. Essentially, I don't want to spend my debt money. <laughs> I want to end each year in a profit now. Now that I'm finally operating at a profit. And again, that's just, that's personal preference. Here, let's, I'm not going to bring up my line. I'll wait till I connect it. Well, okay, let's look at this here. All right, 47. I'm going to write that down. We're at 47 right now. Okay. And when I connect this, that should go way up. And the cool thing, I love, I love that you have to um, say yes or no to the road. Like, it doesn't just quick build it. You actually have to say yes, build this road. Because what you can do is you can stop and be like, okay, is that where I want it? Or you can be like, you know what? Let's put it up. Let's, let's make it go really high. And oh, let's do that, you know. Um, you know, stone bridge, steel bridge, no bridge, you know. Yeah. Etc. 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 I don't want to do that. I'm going to go straight across. I'm actually gonna. It, it just by virtue of me playing with it, it made it more expensive. So I'm gonna go about about 5k, like I said. See, so yeah, look how short this 5k section is because I have to do some road modification, basically. Notice how it's a little bit higher. There we go. I'm following the road, I'm following the terrain now, so it's a little bit less expensive. I didn't mean to you know, I could sit here and make it straight, like, instead of following the slope. But I'm not going to do that. And after the turn of the year, I'm going to quit construction until I get back in the green. Because like I said, I... Want to be always in the green until I'm out of debt. And it might, I might actually go into the red on accident. I don't know. Because of the maintenance at the end. Because I don't know how much my maintenance is per whatever. I'm nearly there, though.
All right, let's do it. Boom. Okay, now let's take a look at our routes. Okay, see, this has rerouted. It's still showing a rate of 47. That should bump up, though. Since I've got a more direct route, it should bump up. And we're going to wait for the turn of the year before we build anything else. So, yeah, I, li I like that, though. Um, okay, yeah, see, we started the year because of all the running costs and everything. We started it in the negative. That'll go up, though, pretty quickly. And how did that not move up? That should move up. Maybe it's waiting for people to get to stations and stuff. Um, I have a new vehicle. I'm not using trains, though, so I don't care. Well, I'm not using trains yet. Okay. You know, it might not actually change the rate that much because this is a, not a bad angle, really. But it's going to definitely help with traffic later. And I don't have anybody on that line yet, either. So we'll, I'm, I'm curious, though. Okay, so with... I, I am going to build a bypass around Oklahoma City. Um, maybe when he gets there, it'll show me. But I am going to build a bypass around Oklahoma City. But that's not going to be for my... What's what I'm looking for? I'm not sure what the word I'm looking for is. That's not going to be for my distro. Like, this is going to help me with my distro. I'm probably going to put a line here and distro right here. That's probably going to, it's going to be for these trucks to not have to go through Oklahoma City. And it went up to 48. So it's a little bit better like i said the, the angle isn't that big of a difference there but see like what i should do here is be like okay i want to go straight to that road so start this and just go straight here straight to the road um i'm not going to yet but that's what i will do eventually when i've got lots of money like, I want this to go perfectly straight. Okay. So, now, do I want to build a bypass around this first? Or do I want to start working on distro first? Okay, so this is going to go from right, wherever I put my distro, it's going to go from right there to right okay so i've got to make this okay here then i may put a small road here to connect um so that way my so i'm looking for i can't think of the word i'm looking for but here's what i need to do i need to put a distro center right here Right there. It won't be used yet, but it'll go right here. And like I said, then I will connect from there. I will cut this as tight as I can and go wherever I can go from here to the distro. Okay. Let's go ahead and put my distro center. We're just going to have a regular truck station. Uh, let's turn it. Okay. And I don't, I don't care this coverage at all. What I care about is just that... There we go. That's all I care about right there. Boom. That it's there. So now, like I said, I need to cut... From there, as tight as I can here. So it'll probably be like right here. 
See, I wish I could, like, focus on it and actually turn on that point. That'd be cool. I can't do that, though. What I can do is come down here and be like, okay. Point the road right there and try to cut that. We'll, we'll give it a little bit more. So then, I'll, like I said, I'll go here. And I'll go right for it. As much, as good as I can, anyway. Hmm. Alright. Let's do it. Hopefully this works. Hopefully I didn't cut it too close. I did not. So, like, I am not actually going to spend, you know, 1.73 million on it. No way. I'm just gonna, I'm gonna come back here and be like, okay. Spend a tiny amount on it at a time. And I'll spend nowhere near that 1.3 million doing it that way either. Doing it just a tiny bit at a time. In my planning stages is where I actually make money. See, while I was doing all that planning, I, you know, had a good amount of profit. So, yeah. Now, if I get up here and I'm not perfectly angled toward it, I can alter it a bit, you know. is that I just get it as straight as I can. Now there is a tool and I thought I had it. Um, maybe I do. I, I had a mod. And it was... I don't know what these do for me. I have no clue. But I had a mod and it basically let me do measurements and make draw straight line distances and stuff like that i don't know what happened to it though i thought it was in terrain um i guess not um let's see i don't even know what, but yeah trees and stuff tree rock miscellaneous all okay what is this Okay, miscellaneous and all. See, I don't... Danger signal right. Huh. Okay. Danger signal left. Danger signal... Ooh, double, yeah. I don't know what that does for me. I don't know if it does anything. I don't know. Let's go back to building a road. Yeah, it was pretty cool because it was basically... It, it gave me access to... It gave me access to some tools, like I said, that let me measure distances. And so I could be like, okay, this is exactly that far. Um, this is the straight line to it. And I, I, I don't know what I did. I guess that mod's not running. This mod, is, well, this wasn't a mod. Like I said, I'm not going to use this, but see, I could go here and be like, you know what? I want a forest right here or whatever this is. Yeah, I want a forest right here. It's cheating. I'm not going to do it. Makes, I mean, it, it's great for testing stuff, though. Which is what I used it for. Okay. So, this is coming along nicely. My thought is, by the time I get my freight going from there to here, that I'll have plenty of money to start working on whatever I was going to do down here. <laughs> I forget. Was it Lafayette? No. It was not Lafayette. It was Flint. And it was using that to that to that. And like I said, at that point, I may just get rid of all these roads and just shoot a straight shot for it. I mean, that's, that's the best way to do it. Like I said, to get, get rid of the roads. 
and just shoot straight shots to whatever you want to do. It's a hassle. It is... It costs money. But it makes money in the end. Look at this. I'm operating in the green. Even with all this construction I'm doing. I love it. And that's going to continue to get more and more and more. Especially, like I said, as I stop to plan or as I stop to take a drink here, that's when I make my money. I could just let this sit and get out of debt. But that is makes for boring gameplay. So we're over halfway there. They're about halfway there. And I shot this pretty good. I could have cut it a little bit closer, but I think I'm okay with it. I'm happy. And for those of you who just now tuning in or didn't see the earlier portions of the video or like whatever, doing this only 5,000 at a time, you can do it at 10,000 at a time. You can choose a number. But doing it a smaller dollar amount at a time saves so much money. It was going to cost me like a million and something to go all the way across. Look at the, look at this. I'm about halfway and this was last year. This is this year. It's only cost me uh, going to cost me about 200,000 instead of a million. I mean, it, it's a crazy amount that you save by doing it this way. Sure, it's a pain in the butt. You've got to go tiny bit by tiny bit. But it saves so much. And the reason is because it's not cutting into the ground as much. You're actually going with the ground instead of trying to cut through. Because if I just went all the way here, you know, boom. It's going to try to cut through the ground or whatever. If I bring it back here, like I said, it, it's, it's going gonna, it's gonna to have me go with the ground. Curious, you like... Okay. I can't get flat enough. And there's not really much there to see. There's a little bit of a contour line there. But, you know, if I was up over there, you'd see more of it. Maybe, you know, be a bigger difference. Auto save. So yes, I'm going painstakingly slow, but that is by design. And I think this would be about perfect though. My shot, was, I mean, from being so far away, I think I shot this pretty well then, okay. So, I'm in the red right now, obviously. I'm, I've got my...